watching K9Love.com. We have health, fitness, fashion, and of course, amazing products from you all across North America. Joining me now is Daniel with BRP. Thank you so much for being here. Well, sir. thank you very much, Sonia. Now, when we saw this, we came in and we thought, oh my goodness, I've never seen this before. But there's a story here. Yeah. Okay, so tell me a little bit about you. Okay. And, and then how that relates to your dog. Okay, well, BRB was founded by our dog courtesy of R2. R2? Uh, yeah. So we discovered the products for antlers for dog, developing uh, the antler choices, and then also then developing new products for the pet industry. So how did R2 help that? Well, she's a large dog. She's a Samoyed, a big white fluffy bear. Uh, she loves to chew. So antler chews has been around for a long time, but they've been quite expensive. Now, what I also like about what your uh, line is all about is nutrition and quality. Yep. So talk about the nutritional component to sure. your treats. So antler chews have been around for since you know the day there was more for the dog industry. Yep. But they've been infamously known for being very expensive because they were defined by pieces and there really isn't a regulation to it. Right. So what, when we stepped into it last year, we kind of re-disrupted the, the segment by selling them by weight. So they're okay. a lot cheaper. People who are familiar with it know they're great. The nutritional factors is virtually 150%. They're natural. Uh, there's no additives. Uh, they clean de uh, dental health. Uh, they there's a bunch of calciums and nutrients right. for them. I was so. gonna say this is they're obviously chewing it, so yep. that's great for their teeth. Yep. And their gums we get sort of all the black. Yeah. And what I also like about your products is that you've got the long for a bigger dog, I'm assuming, yep. and then the smaller for a smaller dog. That's right. They come in all shapes and sizes. Hopefully, you know, for the appropriate size of the dogs. Right. Yep. And they also come in different uh, toughness for them. Now, does it, this won't chip. No, it does not chip. They do not crack. Only lower, poor quality ones do. So okay. predominantly the ones that, you know, good quality ones, they do not chip and crack and odorless. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, and what is this? Is this just decoration? Yeah, this is a part of a whole moose antler. No! So yeah. If someone can want it, they can obviously if take it. I like that. So where do you find these? Uh, we have a family of 14 hounds that go hunt them like truffles in Van, in Van okay. BC. So, Technically, you can find them in Mother Nature, but yes. it takes a more of a uh, organized effort to find them in masses. And yeah. then, do you, how do you produce them, or is uh, there a process to? They just we just cut them and clean them with water and distill water, and that's it. It's simple treatment, so that's why there's no chemicals involved or any type of additive. Nothing like that. I like that. It's completely natural.